uh, lip gloss because that's how I'll call it Pussy Pussy Pizza. Nick, you can have a sleep the whole time. I'm going to see. Well done, mate. Do you want to play the door? Let's see it off. Pass butter. Excellent. Well done. I'm going to turn it on. Yeah. Right, and then you'll have to get the set. Is that? Yeah. Well done, mate. Excellent. Yeah. Splice. Uh, Oh no. It's a belt, isn't it? Yeah, belt car. It's an absolute forte, isn't it, Adam? Yeah. So, this is what he does really, really well. Cleaning the belt on the rug. It's important because it's how the rugs close, so um, they, they get a lot of fur and hay and stuff on them, so it's, it's really important when they go back and they're clean, and also it looks nice to the customer. Makes them a lot more sort of effective to use on the horses um, if they're cleaned. Nick, my sexy Laura, uh, is cheerful in kissing. Uh, Peter Robloff is Christopher Robloff. My name Laura J. Lewis. I do fault in the rugs. And in the bag, bit, bit more folding again, 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 again. <sighs> I like I think it's sexy. Yeah, sexy, cool, and ch chicken monkey. I like his jokes. I love Mid Audibon. Mum top building. He posting me. I said yes. Right, my name's Peter. I'm at the Aldingbourne Country Centre. I work in the rug wash department. Washing horse rugs, duvets, pillows. Today we've been washing horse rugs, washing duvets, drying the duvets, hanging the horse rugs out to dry. Horse rugs has been at Aldingbourne for about 18 months now. Um, it's a real commercial enterprise. Um, it may be slightly different from some of the other departments here because it's been bought in as a social enterprise but it's still very important that we keep the customers happy uh, and it's bringing in real income for the trust that's not based on any kind of government funding or council funding that's money that we're generating for ourselves um, and for that reason we've got to get it right we've got to keep the customers happy at the same time, our main purpose of being here is to meet the needs of the clients. So it's about balancing, giving them a real world commercial experience while meeting their needs, while also meeting the needs of the customers. That can be quite a difficult juggling act sometimes. Adam is a very hard worker. Um, he does a variety of roles in rug wash. He'll load the machine with the rugs, load the machine with duvets, take them out, take the duvets from the machine, from the washing machine, into the dryer, to start the dryer up. He'll bring the horse rugs out, hang them outside to dry. Um, I've seen a huge difference in Adam since he's been working in rug wash. He's become a lot more focused. When he first came, he needed a lot more, a lot more guidance, a lot more help. Um, whereas now he comes in, he's got his specific jobs, he'll very much get on with them, 
And apart from stopping to have the odd dance every now and again, he'll just get on with it. And very occasionally you'll hear a peep out of him, otherwise he just sticks to what he's doing and works very, very hard. I think Horse Rugs gives Adam a focus. It gives him a place that he can come where he's working with his other friends, um, so he has a social interaction, but also it gives him a real focus. He knows what he's going to do. So I think it really helps Adam to know that uh, he's doing a real a real job on a real product that's going out to a real customer that's going to be charged real money for it, so he's got to get it right. I think we're definitely on the right track. I guess it's just about growing the business, making it bigger and trying to get more clients in, more customers in, to making the biggest business bigger so that we have more turnover at the end of the year and that's kind of what we're working towards anyway. We're constantly out there marketing through word of mouth or leafleting um, and I guess just growing the business so that we generate more turnover. Bad rock. <laughs>